What is up guys, so time to do speed test comparison between Galaxy Note 9 comparing with the Samsung Galaxy S6 Edge Plus. So guys, this speed test comparison is just a fun video here between these two devices. I know this is kind of 2015, really old device, still people using it, so that's the reason I'm doing this speed test comparison. So I'm going to give you all the specs about these two devices here. Quickly, I'm just going to give you side-by-side -side comparison here. So as you can see, what's new is the Bixby Bun here. On the bottom as you can see S Pen because of Note series and we have a right there uh, micro USB charging compared to Type-C just now uh, power key there on top same similar things on the back we have a dual set of camera compared to single camera but still we have flash and higher monitor available at that time as well as the home button which is figment scanner as well anyway let me just boot this up and give you more specs about the device one two three and let's see guys which one actually booted up faster I think uh, maybe the newer version which is Note 9 should be faster but let's see which one booted up here and uh, sorry about the lighting guys um, both are really bright right now anyway yep Note 9 booted up faster after like 5 seconds and edge version just built it up properly both of them so guys as you can see the display on both the both are super AMOLED display here and we have a 5.7 inch comparing 6.4 inch and the resolution pixel density are similar we have 515 for both uh, pixel density here compared to resolution we have 1440 by 2960 for the note 9 comparing 1440 by 2560 for this edge plus here and Believe it or not guys, a lot of people love this Edge Plus device. In fact, I also have a 6 Edge. I did use it for two years and I really like it. Still, I like it. I still use it for some time. Anyway guys, uh, for that time of year, we have a Exynos 7420 processor with Mali T760 GPU. Now in 2018, we have Qualcomm Snapdragon 845 processor with Adreno 630 GPU with the 6 gigs of RAM comparing 4 GB RAM in Edge Plus here. Now they can shoot 4K videos on the back cameras guys. On the front they can shoot only 1080p videos right now. One of them running Android Nougat comparing an Oreo. This device here is the latest update. I, It's not a beta version or anything. That's the official update for that device. So I only have that right now at the moment. But anyway guys we have 4000 mAh battery in one of them. Other one is 2000 mAh battery which is you know what. So let's just find out guys which phone is faster between these two here. So starting from phone dial application, one, two, three. Edge plus here. Play store. This time it's note nine. Messenger. Note nine. And let me know guys which phone you think is faster. Obviously the new version will be faster, but still this is just fun speed desk comparison video anyway. Snapchat. No, nine, only like a one or two second difference between the application here. Twitter. And as you can see, guys, still a one or two second difference. This time it's note nine, but anyway, Instagram. Again, note nine. Facebook. I think same time. Some games, Subway Surfer. Also, we're going to see some color difference between this display, but still, as you can see, guys, they are really close. But Note 9 is faster. And I'm just going to play a little bit here. And I can see here, guys, they both are really close display, color-wise. Temple on 2. Also, we're going to see some color difference on this game as well. And let's see which one loader faster. Note 9 after like two second maybe and finish here edge plus anyway as you can see the color wise guys they are really close display i'm just gonna play a little bit so you can see the difference here between the display here and as you can see this side of sand is really darker compared to lighter color on this side now asphalt 9 Uh, so that's one gig lighter game so let's see which one faster 
probably no nine after like a two second is edge plus here so next is model combat x and let's see which one load up faster as you can see guys they are the same point right now and let's see all right note 9 and some reason this crash here so I'm not gonna open it anyway releasing 3 and let's see which one load up faster so guys as you can see I think I'm gonna crash just like a Mortal Kombat X crash here so let's see still actually it's on but it's just kind of black display right now and uh, something wrong and as you can see here after like 10 seconds it just booted up again so I'm gonna wait anyway just boot it up now so next I'm gonna open uh, setting and a note 9 next I'm gonna open Chrome that will be Samsung website and note 9 load up the page faster still loading here next I'm gonna open internet that will be Wikipedia website again note 9 load up faster and as you can see that color wise guys they are really close color so guys, I'm going to do some multitasking. I'm not going to open too much application here. I'm going to open two to three application that proves does do multitasking. Uh, let's just open uh, Subway Surfer first game. And still in the background. Let's open uh, Instagram. Actually refresh over there. And again, guys, I just told you fun speed test comparison, so it's kind of fun video. But anyway, Facebook, just in the background, I'm gonna open another application which will be let's open a Messenger. Actually, as you can see, guys, both phone refresh actually, no nine as well as Edge Plus. Anyway, guys, anyway, guys, let's run a Geekbench score. So that is about the device between these two as, as I told you guys to bring Android Nougat comparing Android Oreo right now this is the latest update I get it on this device no beta or nothing running here fresh out of factory running so anyway I'm just gonna simply run it one two three so yeah guys I'll catch you in a few seconds soon as they are done now guys as you can see that's the score just kind of half of a score in Edge Plus compared to Note 9 Anyway guys, that's the score between these two devices 2015 comparing 2018 device. Obviously, 2018 will be much more faster comparing 2015 device. Anyway guys, let me know what you're thinking about the speed test comparison between these two devices. As I told you guys, it's kind of fun speed test comparison video. So, let me know guys, what are you thinking personally? I know a lot of people are still using this Edge 6 Edge or S6 or S6 S Plus. It's a really awesome phone, guys. So let me know what are you thinking. Leave a thought in comment below. I'll catch you next video. Peace out.